Hello everybody, welcome back to our Ridgeside series. So today I think we've got a bunch of stuff to get on with. We have the merchant in town and it's a good luck day, so we should probably do mining or something maybe. Let me check the mail. Okay, Jodie wants us to bring her a cauliflower, we can definitely do that. Although, are we friending Jodie? Not really. Oh, we've got some parsnips to harvest here. Oh, I have the experience again. Do I have to keep doing this? I think I do. This is not deja vu. This is a new video. I just have to keep doing this every time. <laughs> okay, that's all done. I need to remember to do that before I start recording next time. Okay, let's water quickly and plant our other parsnips because we do need gold quality parsnips. We only have two parsnips left, so I guess we'll plant those for now. Where's my watering can as well? Oh, I should put on another copper bar. Oh my gosh, I'm everywhere today. Also, right before recording this episode, I burnt my hand. <laughs> if I'm playing a little bit badly, I'm gonna blame it on that today because I can barely touch my mouse. It hurts so bad. So I'm kind of holding my mouse really weirdly. So I'm gonna blame it on that. So yeah, if I'm playing weird, blame the burnt hand. <laughs> I think it should be fine. I just um, dropped an entire brand new cup of tea on it. Like I just poured out my tea and um, I dropped the whole cup of tea on my hand and it really hurt. <laughs> so yeah, but yeah, how has everyone's week been? I hope everyone is doing well. It's so nice to be recording again. I love sitting down at the end of the day getting ready to record this series. It's just so cozy. This series feels like my personal me time. It feels like I'm relaxing and hanging out. Also, I'm sorry if you can hear any really loud wind. We're actually having a storm here in the Netherlands at the moment, so it's really loud outside. There is a lot of wind. Okay, let's put the watering can away we now have like barely any energy let's go down to the merchant and see what she's got for sale as well oh oh no i picked this up okay i think it was there oops <laughs> sorry if that's moved locations i think it was where was it was it there i think so right let's go down to the merchant oh yeah we got our chicken oh my gosh here's our chicken hello little chicken and their name is egg i think we could probably buy like a couple more chickens today we might do that now and you all gave me some really good names in the comments of the last video for chickens so i'll name them some of your name suggestions okay what do you have for me for today oh the tilapia we could grab that i know we will need the tilapia as i said i'm not so fussed about completing community center year one or anything or honestly not really fussed about completing it very quickly at all. I'd rather spend money on chickens right now so we can have a really cute little family on our little farm. We'll see how many chickens we can buy and if we have leftover money maybe we'll go back for the tilapia because that is pretty handy for the bundle. Purchase animals. Hi Marnie. I really like the name chickpea which was suggested. I think that's really cute because chick I don't know. I think that's really cute. And can we afford another one? Okay, we can afford one more. Let's do it. Yeah, one more chicken. And this one we will name Cashew. I think that's really cute too. We've gone for very food themed chicken names. I quite like that. Maybe we'll stick with the food theme. So we've got little Cashew. Oh my gosh, let's go and meet them now. Oh, I should probably buy some hay. Do we have a silo yet? Should I craft a silo today? Maybe that's something we need to work on today, getting everything we need for a silo. Let's go meet our baby chickens. I'm excited. There they are. Oh my gosh, so cute. I do need some food for them though. So I guess we need to work on what we need for a silo. I think a silo, you need like some clay and some copper bars, which we have a bunch of copper bars. I wonder how much clay we have already. Yeah, we have loads of copper bars right now. Okay, we have seven clay. Is it 10 clay that we need. We need 100 gold, 100 stone, 10 clay, and five copper bars. We've definitely got enough for the copper bars. We need a little bit more clay. I think we have enough stone actually. And we do have enough money. We just need the clay. Okay, here's what we need for the silo. We just need three clay. Now I wonder if I can get that. I will need a hoe actually. I wonder what the quickest way to get clay is. Perhaps in the mines? Would that be quickest? Let's go up to the mines and see. Like I can just hoe the dirt in the mines perhaps. Excuse me cat. Oh no, I'm trapped. <laughs> I'm trapped on the farm from my cat. There we go. If you just keep running, they will move. I love when the spring blossom is all in the air. It's so cute. Okay, we need to find one of those floors that's got like sand on it. Yeah, we have none in here. Like if I just hoe these spots, surely I'll get clay from this, right? There's one. Okay, we need two more. Oh, got cave carrot. Getting all sorts of goodies here. <laughs> I guess it's a good luck day. Oh no, not an infested floor, really? Oh my gosh, I hate these bugs. They suck. Is that all? Is there any more of you? Oh, yes there is. And another one. That's always fun, right? And another one. And more. Please just give me clay. Ah. <laughs> Finally. That took long enough. Another piece of clay. Finally. We need one more. Oh! We got it! 
We got 10. Okay, I might just grab a little bit of copper whilst we're here. But we've got our 10. Oh, I should actually really go to Robin's. When does she sharp? Let's head to Robin's quickly. I don't know if she's already sharp, maybe. Hopefully not. Really like to get the silo today. Oh my gosh, she just walked through that leak. Did you see that? She got some buzzy text thing above her head. I would have had that leak. Oh, she's already gone. No. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we miss Robin, but I might go and see Alyssa. Let's go and see how she is. Hey there, Lil. What are you up to? We have two hearts with her. Take care now. Can we not talk more? Is that it? What can I give her? Oh, I have nothing to give her. Such sadness. <laughs> okay, well, at least we've got everything we need for the silo. We can definitely get that tomorrow. And we can afford it, although we have no money. So we should probably fish or something. Maybe for the rest of the evening we should spend it fishing because I spent all my money on chickens today. And I think while that was a worthwhile investment, we now are poor, so we should fish. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go fish now for the rest of the evening. I didn't bring any gifts with me though. Probably should have done that. There is forageables though, so I could give these as gifts. Although I don't know if they're very liked by anyone. Oh my gosh, there's Floor. Wait, Floor likes these, right? I hope. I've already given Floor two gifts this week. That's enough. No, at least I can talk to her. Oh, hi. Anything else? Is that it? That's good though. We've talked to Alyssa and Floor today, both of the potential love interests. I think the day will come soon where we have to decide which one we want and it's going to be a very sad day. Right, let's fish here then. Our favourite little fishing spot. I cannot reach these bubbles. They are way too far away. <laughs> I wonder how long I can actually fish here for because we'll have to leave very soon. We've gotten here very late to be fair. Also, I have no energy so... I'm already feeling exhausted. <laughs> okay, so I got a bit carried away with fishing. So we're gonna head back now, hopefully make it home in time. All we managed to get was Ridgeside Bass and Trash. So not the best fishing trip we've ever had, but at least we've made a little bit of money with it. I should also check the bins if we have time on the way home. Although we are really scraping by on time. We only have two hours until we pass out. So we've got to hurry up a little bit. Wow, we got more trash, which is superb honestly <laughs> is that olga you know it's late when olga's walking around and here's Isabel too i admire leah's attitude she specializes in abstractions but there's a certain class to her work but don't steal my leah although in this save we've not even got our eyes for leah hi corin hello leo i hope you're having a nice day let's give corin some arugula this is a nice gift thanks we do need to work on all of our friendships if we want to you know move story progression on and such okay let's sell what we got we just got some Ridgeside Bass really um, and I got some rice shoots so I think I'm going to sell those too. I do have parsnips to sell but I think we're going to keep them for now maybe. I would quite like to be making a little bit more money than this. <laughs> oh we could make some seed packets. Let's make some wild seeds. They're always fun to sell. Let's sell those quickly. I can't help but think that we should have mined today because it was a good luck day. Hopefully we get another good luck day tomorrow. But let's sleep now. Oh, we leveled up in fishing. Nice. Level four. We finally got the recycling machine. Now we can put all of that trash to good use. Let's make a recycling machine in the morning. Okay, we made like less than a grand. That's not so good. Day 20 of spring. Almost through spring. We've got like a week left. Okay, we've got rain tomorrow and Shane's birthday tomorrow. And it's a bad luck day. <laughs> I could again. Let's go and get the silo today, at the very least. <laughs> what do we need for a recycling machine? We need an iron bar, so we do need to mine a little bit further then. That will take us a while then, because we're not even at the iron levels, I don't think. We've got one day until our strawberries are done, so we're going to have a massive harvest of strawberries. We have a potato harvest now, that's pretty good. Oh yeah, I think I was going to replace these potatoes with parsnips, so maybe we'll go to Pierre's and get some parsnip seeds. Okay, we can go and grab 10 parsnip seeds from Pierre's, and... And we'll also do the silo, of course. Oh, I still haven't fed my chickens yet. Oops. <laughs> I need to get them some food. I really need to get the silo. I should probably go and buy food anyways because the silo will take a few days. Right, money, open up, please. Okay, supply shop. I'll buy like... 10 hay for now that should do us for a while thanks marnie that actually costs so much money at least we can feed our chickens though let's go to pierre's first i think and then we'll go up to robin's after hello floor huh you seem to have a lot of time on your hands what do you mean by that oh i didn't mean to be rude i just because you stopped by to say hi that's all oh my god she's so sweet she never means to be rude like she just says things awkwardly oh i have a cutscene. i'm gonna skip it this is vanilla cutscene. We're skipping all of those. Okay, let's sell him my potatoes and we'll buy back 10 parsnip seeds. And we'll go and plant those parsnip seeds after we've got the silo. Yeah, I wonder what Floor would like. 
and Alyssa too, I really don't know what their loved items would be. I need to investigate a little bit. I need to get adventurous with what I give them. But the risk with that is that they're not going to like it and then you're going to lose loads of friendships so I'm a bit scared. Hello, can we get the silo? Oh no, that's where I was going to place it. That's so annoying. Um, I guess we have to put it on this side for now then. We can always move it at a later point. That's so annoying. <laughs> I guess it's gonna go here for now. Yay! Thanks, Robin. I guess we could fish another day, but I just feel like that's a very boring episode. We kind of need to do that for money, you know? Although we will have strawberries tomorrow, so that's pretty good. Let's plant these parsnips. Okay, hopefully we get some gold ones with that. I could make some fertilizer to increase our chance. Okay, I made some fertilizer. Hopefully this will help us get gold quality. I should also keep making copper bars because we're gonna need them to upgrade our axe. Oh, we actually have enough. We can upgrade our axe as soon as we have money. How much wood do we have? We don't have a lot. So maybe we'll spend today chopping a bunch of wood. Although we still need money. Let's chop a bunch of wood around our farm. And soon we can scythe this. That will be amazing once we can do that. Because this is a big old mess right now. Let's clear this a little bit then. And get the resources from here too. Also, when I was reading through the comments for name suggestions, I saw someone suggest that they love animals with human names like Tim or Carol. I thought that was such a good idea. Maybe for all our cows, they'll have human names. We could do each animal having a different category of names. So for our chickens, I think they're clearly food names. So maybe for our cows, they could be human names. I think that would be really fun. Okay, I've actually cleared most of the farm, but I kind of need a new space to plant trees. I think it would be good to have some organized trees, even if it's not how it stays forever. I think for now, I might just plant a couple trees along here. I don't think this will be our permanent tree farm, but I do think it's good to have some trees planted because we're gonna need more for wood as well so this might not be our tree farm for tappers. I'm gonna plant a bunch more here and I might make the rest of these into field snacks because they're pretty handy. Once we get an earth crystal we can make one of these mayonnaise machines. Do we already have an earth crystal I wonder? How much wood did we get as well? We got 154 wood, that's pretty good. But we do have an earth crystal, we can make a mayonnaise machine just because we're gonna get eggs soon you know. And I think I'm gonna go chop more trees maybe in this area too purely because if I'm putting my axe into the shop I want to have as much wood as I can get. Okay, I've spent all day clearing the farm. We've got so many resources now. We definitely need some torches or something to light up this area. I kind of want to hold off until we get batteries and can craft the wooden lamppost because we do have the recipe already. But I think we have to wait till the summer for that at least. And we got 251 wood, so I'm feeling pretty good about that. And I'm quickly going to make a mayo machine as well so we can put that out in the chicken house. Let's head to sleep. We did not make any money today and we didn't level up either. Okay, it's a rain day and it's a good luck day, finally. And we got a recipe and the merchant. This is a good old day. Let's get our recipe quickly. Radish salad, nice. Okay, so we don't have to water, which is amazing. We also can go and upgrade our tool. I think if we have enough strawberries, I think we can upgrade our tool, which is amazing. And we can go mining today because we've got good luck day. So this is all pretty perfect. Did we get our strawberries? We did, we have our first harvest of strawberries. This is perfect. We can sell these all to Pierre for immediate money. I'm gonna check on my chickens. Oh, I need more hay for them. Oops, I'm gonna put my mayo maker down here and let's head off to the merchant. Oh, she has a star fruit seed already and a periwinkle and a large egg and a large milk. Oh my gosh. And the stump seat. <laughs> oh no. Um, I don't think we should buy any of these things. I mean, a periwinkle would be pretty handy for the crab pot, but I feel like the crab pot's never too hard to get anyways. Oh, we've already finished the crab pot? When did we do that? That's amazing. <laughs> large egg, I'm sure we're gonna get eventually, and large milk too. I don't think we need to bother with any of these things. I think no. I honestly feel like I never buy anything from the merchant these days. I'm always just like, I'll get that eventually, it's fine. <laughs> right, let's go to Pierre's and then we'll go to Clint's. Hopefully I have enough money to get the upgraded copper axe. I don't know how much it is. Is it 2,000? In which case I think we should get enough money. Come on, Pierre. I'm banging on the door. Let me in. How much do we get? We have 5k, over 5k. That is such good money. I can't help but think we need more parsnip seeds, but I'm gonna hold off on them for now. Although we do not have that much longer. I just wonder if we're gonna get enough gold quality. Can we upgrade our copper axe, please? Okay, we still have 3k left and we're gonna go mining now. So this is gonna be a pretty perfect mines day, I hope. We're gonna get loads of resources. We're gonna get some iron. Maybe we can get some gems and stuff that we can give as gifts and see if people like those in Ridgeside. Okay, floor 30, let's go. Oh, is this the dark floors? Oh, it is. Oh, no. I might actually bring one of these torches with me so that if it's too dark, 
I can at least see where I'm going. So we haven't made it to the ice floors yet, so we're gonna need to do that today. Little tip, if you haven't got a glow ring yet, just use one of these torches to guide your way around. Oh my gosh, I can't find this ladder anywhere. I've gone around the whole floor now. There it is, finally. I hate these floors with such a passion, but they are good for copper. Okay, we made it to 35. That is halfway of these floors done. And we got the ladder already. Loads of copper on this floor. I'm not having the easiest time finding these ladders, I can't lie. I hate the noises of these things. I've cleared like the whole floor. Oh my gosh, there, finally. Okay, there's a freebie over here. And a bunch of copper, perfect almost down to 40 it doesn't have a freebie ladder why would it be so easy i guess the game doesn't want to be that easy does it we got the ladder okay we're down to 40 finally and we got the slingshot that's really good we can get some iron today let's head up quickly and dump some stuff with this level of pickaxe it's going to be a little bit hard to break things on these floors now oh we got an amethyst Oh my gosh, it takes so long to break these now. Three hits for each rock. Oh, we've accidentally made it to 45 already. Okay, <laughs> I'll take it. I'm gonna head back up and I think I'm gonna go back to 40 and just keep trying to get a little bit more iron. Oh my gosh, three bats all at once? Excuse me? Who do you think you are? Okay, killed those. Get some iron and then we'll probably head home. I think we did really well. We got down 10 floors, we got a load of iron and copper. I mean, we didn't get that much iron. We got like 15 pieces. Put on an iron bar for a change and I'll dump everything in the chest. Okay, and let's head to bed. I don't think we made any money again. Well, except for strawberries at the beginning of the day. And we leveled up in farming. Finally, we've got the preserves jar. I'm so excited for that. We can preserve a bunch of stuff now and make a little bit more money. And we leveled up in mining too. And we got the miner's treat. Nice. And combat. Hello. Today was the day of productivity. I can't lie. <gasps> we've got a cutscene with Yuma. <gasps> Ooh, but I do think I'm gonna finish up there. I'm sorry it's such a short episode, but my hand is really hurting from where I burnt it. So I'm gonna go and rest a little bit, but I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope to get another part out for you very soon. But yeah, have a lovely rest of your day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye everyone.